feed the children, period. That's the motto of Children's Meal Mission. The Anchorage-based charity hopes to combat child hunger throughout the state by 2014. And for this week's Making a Difference, Marty joins us in the studio with the executive director of Children's Meal Mission, Don Burrell. Now over to Marty. Well, good morning, Don. Thank you so much for joining us so early in the morning. Yeah, good morning. Thank you. So I want you to tell us more about the mission. Well, Children's Mill Mission was founded originally in 2009. Um, our founder, George Bell, um, honestly and truthfully, um, went into the Mountain View Boys and Girls Club, saw that there was not a, um, a food program for the kids um, at the time, and um, did some research and found out that there hadn't been one there for quite some time. So uh, he made a commitment to the Boys and Girls Club manager that he would serve food for the next year. Um, after a year, or close to a year, um, he and I um, and uh, an associate of mine mm -hmm. uh, joined forces, basically, and um, came to the conclusion that we needed to start uh, our own program. Um, and that's where Children's Mill Mission came from. And for people at home that don't know what food insecure is, can you define food insecure homes? Yes. Um, the simplest way is um, food insecure for a child means that basically there's no guarantee that that child is receiving uh, three balanced meals a day. Um, they may have the guarantee during school uh, of a um, school lunch. Uh, and they may also have a, a school breakfast, which some schools actually offer. And what is your target audience? Um, children between the ages of uh, 5 and 18, school age. I also, because the numbers are alarming, uh, food insecure families exist in 17.2 million households in America, 3.9 million of them with children. According to your statistics, how many food insecure children are there in Anchorage? Well, based on the statistics given out by the state of Alaska um, Ch um, Department of Education, um, there's about 43% of the entire student population of Alaska mm -hmm. um, are food insecure. And that totals up to about 52,000 children. Also, what areas of Anchorage do you currently do you currently serve and can you tell me more about the charity's goal for 2014? Yes, um, we serve right now at the Mountain View Boys and Girls Club and the Woodland Park Boys and Girls Club. Um, and our goal is um, to expand our mission statewide. Mm -hmm. um, we have the goal in the next year, actually, of reaching um, some hub communities, uh, Dillingham, Fairbanks, um, hopefully Matsu, uh, Kenai, and expanding further here in Anchorage. Your charity is also preparing a long-term feasibility study. I'm just going to have you quickly expand on that. Uh, basically, we want to um, uh, take those numbers um, uh, that the state of Alaska Department of Education puts out and um, uh, uh, do what our mission says, feed the children, period. Mm -hmm. um, we don't want to limit our services to anyone. We want um, any child that is hungry to have access to free food, free meals. Well, thank you so much for joining us this morning. And for more information for people at home on the Children's Meal Mission, you can log on to our website at ktuu.com for all the details. Now back to Sheila and Corey. All right, thank you, Marty.